Buckley isn't the one who blew up the Megalomart. In the season 2 finale, Propane Boom, Strickland Propane goes out of business. Due to the supermarket in the area, Megalomart beginning to carry propane and selling it at way lower prices. After losing his job, Hank goes to Megalomart for employment. While working there, he sees Buckley dragging a propane tank across the ground by its valve. He warns Buckley not to do this because it could cause an explosion and hurt a lot of people. But Buckley continues doing it. Eventually, when only Hank, Luann, and Buckley are in the building, it explodes. Hank and Luann are okay, sustaining only minor injuries, but Buckley is killed, presumably because he was the source of the explosion. But that wasn't the case. The average supermarket is well ventilated and 40,000 square feet. The Megalomart looks larger than that. What Buckley was doing is dangerous, but it's unlikely that the minor leaks that he was causing by holding onto one valve at a time would result in such a large explosion. Much like Hank, there are other people who are working at the Megalomart who lost their jobs, those having to compete with the corporation. One of them is Ray Holiday, former owner of Ray's Bait and Tackle. When his shop went out of business, he set it on fire for insurance money, and he would do it again, releasing the valves on multiple propane tanks and waiting.